Hey everybody, it's Paige and welcome to Vlogmas Day 21. Today's video is my long-awaited lip declutter. We have a lot of drawers to go through today, so I'm going to keep this intro short. We're going to be starting off with my lip gloss drawer. So in here we have almost all of my lip glosses, but I actually have a few down here aside that were other places in my collection. And I'm realizing I have even more. So you know what? I'm going to take you off the tripod and give you an overview before we start decluttering just so you guys can have an idea of what we have planned today. Paige says she's going to keep the intro short and then does not keep the intro short. <laughs> okay, so um, I have quite a few lip drawers. We have this one here which has lip balms, lip masks, lip scrubs, that type of thing. We have this one which is my lip gloss drawer. Then we have a lipstick drawer, which has mostly like bullet lipsticks. Then we have a liquid lipstick drawer. Then if we bring it back up here, we have my new makeup drawers and there's actually quite a few lip products within these drawers. So I think I'm gonna start these new makeup drawers fresh when I move. So. I'm gonna grab all of the lip products that are in these drawers. I have those two plus this one is like kind of different. It's not really new makeup. <laughs> and then we have this drawer which is basically all lip products. And then I also have some lip glosses down here as well as some other miscellaneous lip products here. So I think I'm actually gonna start by taking out all of my lip products from these drawers and setting them down here. Okay, so here are all of the products that were in other drawers or other places, not in their proper lip categorized drawer. So <laughs> this is already like way more than a regular collection should be. So I'm gonna organize through this stuff into categories. So like lip glosses, liquid lipsticks, lipstick bullets, lip liners, that type of thing. And then we will go through these as we go through the corresponding drawer. I am decluttering my lip products while simultaneously watching Samantha March's lip gloss declutter. So just thought I would mention that out. <laughs> um, I love Samantha March in her video. She's awesome. You guys should go check her out if you don't watch her. So I just separated out all of my lip glosses. I'm pretty sure you can't even see all of them, but I'm pretty sure these are all of the lip glosses from that massive pile. There may be a few others kind of intertwined or like if I'm not sure, like there was one, this one, I don't know if this is a lip gloss or a liquid lipstick. So we'll kind of get to those, but these are the ones that I know for sure are lip glosses or lip creams, basically like a glossy finish. So these are the glosses in addition to that drawer that you saw at the beginning. So let's go through the drawer and then we will kind of go through this as we go through the drawer. I hope that made sense. I don't know. But I realized I forgot to say if you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy. And let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so here we have my lip gloss drawer. This is where all of my lip glosses should be living. Um, the organizer in here is from Sunny Cosmetics. It's a super awesome organizer. I really like it a lot. It's made for the Alex Nine drawers from Ikea. So 
if you have these drawers. I definitely recommend their organizers. Um, but we're gonna go through these lip glosses. So I don't even know what's in here. Um, there's a few that are missing, but I want all of my lip glosses to fit in the drawer. And as you guys saw, there's a ton sitting on the floor next to me. So let's start off with this first row here. First, these are all from Alomar Cosmetics. I love Alomar Cosmetics lip glosses, but I definitely have too many of them. So here are the eight that I have. I'm pretty sure, see, this is the problem. I don't even remember what the new packaging is. Like, is this the new packaging or is this the new packaging? I, I don't know, um, but I'm pretty sure I have color duplicates here. I'm gonna check their Instagram to see <laughs> which packaging is the new packaging. Okay, so the ones with the kind of like cream caps, this is the new packaging. So we have Dulce, which is a stunning nude color. We have Miami Spice. I love this color so much. We have Chula, and we have Birthday Suit. Birthday Suit is my favorite from Alomar Cosmetics. In the old packaging, I have Birthday Suit. I have Miami Spice Latte. I have another Miami Spice Latte and another Birthday Suit. So since this is the old packaging, and I have two of each of the old packaging, we're gonna declutter these four and we're just gonna keep one of each of the new packaging. Next, we have some glosses back here from Il Maquillage, I think is how you say it. This, this is the uh, collaboration, or I guess maybe one of the collaborations with Carly Bible. These are really nice glosses and I kinda wanna keep them, so. We're gonna see if this if they fit. Um, I definitely will kind of like probably do a couple rounds. I'm gonna go through them all, declutter what I initially want to declutter, and then if everything doesn't fit, then we will kind of revisit and see what we can do. Back here, I have this, <laughs> which is kind of a crazy color. This is the Sorbet, I don't even know what this is. This is a collaboration with Chloe Morello. I'm gonna go ahead and declutter that because I'm probably not gonna use that color. I don't even know if that's a lip color. <laughs> Next, we have a bunch of Morphe lip glosses. This is gonna be difficult for me to go through, but it needs to be done. I love Morphe's lip gloss formula, but I know, I know for a fact that some of these, sorry my camera cut me off, but I was saying I know for a fact that some of these are old and need to go so we've got Frosé. this shade is phenomenal that one can definitely stay i also have two glosses in the shade boho this is another one of my favorite glosses from morphe i love the color but i don't need two so i'm gonna keep one and declutter this one i also have the madison beer collaboration in the shade venus which i think i'm gonna keep for now and then this one is Frolic. I somewhat recently bought this shade. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's kind of like a peachy color with a gold shimmer. Wow, this is actually really difficult. I have this one in the shade Beach Goals. Um, you know what? I'm, I have to check the website to see if these shades are available. Okay, so um, I'm looking online and I wanted to keep this one, but I don't think they sell this shade anymore. This is in the shade Beach Goals. It's a really pretty champagne shimmery gloss, but that one is gonna go. I'm also gonna declutter Sauced because again, I don't think that this one is available anymore. We have the shade Chill, which is a really pretty nude, and they do still sell that shade. And then we're just gonna go ahead and declutter these last four. I don't know if they still sell these shades or not, but we're just gonna go ahead and get rid of them. So I'm decluttering six Morphe glosses, and I'm keeping five for now. I'm actually decluttering seven Morphe glosses. Next, we have Pixie back here, and I have some really pretty colors but I should not keep all of these. Look at these colors, you guys. I am, ugh, I love. So I don't need the clear one. The clear one can definitely go. Uh, this peach one is stunning. This is Sweet Nectar. I have to keep that one. <laughs> it's beautiful. And then I have these two, which I really, really, really wanna keep, but I don't think I should. These are also Chloe Morello collabs, so I feel like these are a little bit older. So I think I'm gonna pass them along, even though I wanna keep them so bad. I kinda, maybe I'll keep this one. Oh my gosh. Okay, this one is so pretty. It's like 
the lighter pink sparkly one we'll keep that one for now um <laughs> and we'll see what happens next we have buxom i have a ton of buxom glosses here um so let's just take these out and take a peek at what we have okay so i have different collections some of them have like a silver cap like this some of them have a pink cap and then i have a few that have like this gold cap so, um, I'm going to keep the gold ones. I have Pippa Pumpkin and Spiced Vanilla Latte. These are both really new, so I feel good keeping those. Let's go ahead and look at the pink ones. Um, one of them is my favorite. This is Dolly Daiquiri. I love this shade. It's fantastic. We've got um, Tulum Teeny, I think is how you say it. I probably won't wear that color very often. This one is Bahama Mama. That is so pretty. I'm going to keep that one. I'm going to declutter Pacific Punch and Ibiza Bomb, even though both of these are stunning. I just have too many. I have to be picky. Oh my goodness, do you guys hear that? What the heck? Um, and then this one, I don't know how you say the name, but we're going to keep it. I can't tell if that's my upstairs neighbors or my downstairs neighbors. Well, anyway, um, we're going to move on to the silver caps. So we've got Bloody Mary, which is a really pretty red gloss. We've got Dolly, which again is stunning. And then we've got Frosé. I'm going to look at these as a whole. Um, this one I know is old. This is Erica. It's really pretty. It's a pink sparkly gloss, but that one needs to go. This one is also pretty old. I feel like maybe, I don't know, this one's in the shade Autumn. I'm going to declutter that one. We've got Hazel. Um, I think I'm gonna declutter that one. We've got Caroline, Samantha, and Dolly. Um, I feel, I kind of like all three of these, so maybe we'll keep those three for now. And then we have these ones which have like the frosted component. So we've got Spiked Apple Cider, which is really pretty. We've got Melon Mimosa, and then we've got Irish Coffee and White Russian. I think I might keep those for now, and then we'll declutter these three. We've got Bloody Mary, Frosé, and Spike, Pumpkin Spice Latte. This, th those are hard for me to get rid of because I love Buxom glosses. Like, the formula is amazing, and those shades are beautiful, but like I said, I need to get rid of some, and I'm already feeling like I'm going to have to go back and get rid of more. Next, we have some iconic London glosses, which these are beautiful colors. I love every single one of them, but they're all pretty old. So I'm going to go ahead and declutter all three of those. We've got some With Love Cosmetics glosses, which again are pretty old. I've had these for a really long time, and I really love the packaging, but I need to let them go. We have an Anastasia Beverly Hills gloss. This is really old. Dominique Cosmetics gloss. This is really old. I have some uh, Glam Light and Michaela glosses. I am actually going to keep those because I really like their formula. I have a Charlotte Tilbury gloss, which I'm definitely going to keep. I have some Lunar Beauty glosses, definitely going to keep. Um, and then we've got some e.l.f. ones, which I'm going to go ahead and declutter these mint melt ones just because I just, I haven't used those since I filmed that review, so they can go. And then we've got Pink Cosmo and Champagne Glam. I really like both of these from e.l.f., so I think I will keep those. This is from NYX. This is a Filler Instinct Glitter Gloss. That is so pretty. Um, Laura Mercier. These are stunning. We've got Rose Gold Accent and Blush. I forgot I had these. I need to use those. We have this Sephora Gloss. I've had this for a while. That can go. Um, I have this e.l.f. Jelly Pop Juicy Gloss. I have some other glosses that are in this packaging that I... Mm, I was going to get rid of it. 
Mm, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of it. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm sorry. Don't get mad at me, please. I'm not gonna get rid of it. This can go. This is really old. That's from NARS. That's so pretty. My camera cut me off again. I keep forgetting that it turns off by itself. Um, these are from NYX. These are not super old. I got them pretty recently. They're the It's, or this is Milky Glosses. So I think I'm actually gonna keep those. This is from CoverGirl. I can let that one go. This is from Makeup Revolution. I can also let that one go. We have a ton of potassium cosmetics glosses. Oh, along with some other ones. So let me pull these all out. So I have some new glosses from potassium cosmetics that I'm gonna put in here. Um, she came out with these, let's see, when was that? Um, a few months ago, I think during the fall. So I'm gonna put the new potassium glosses in here. Next, I have these from Milani, which I'm definitely gonna keep. I love using these. They are freaking awesome. I actually have another one down here that I'm just gonna pop up here. I have my butter glosses. This is a Dior Glow Oil. This is from Urban Decay. I think I'm gonna declutter this because I don't ever use that. Then we have Patrick Ta. I definitely wanna keep Patrick Ta. We have some more Charlotte Tilbury glosses. These are fantastic. I'm definitely keeping those. Um, and then I have some other random ones back here that I think I'm probably just gonna go ahead and declutter all of these. I didn't even know that these were back here, so all of these are gonna go. Um, and then these ones are from Kaja. I do wanna keep these. These are so pretty and they are pretty new. Um, we've got some Ofra, which I'm gonna keep, and some Maybelline, which I'm gonna keep. So now, um, this is what the drawer is looking like. I need to go through everything that's down here that y'all can't see, and we're gonna go through that as we put it into this drawer to make it fit. Okay, so we've got another Glam Light gloss, which is gonna go here. We've got a few Loyalty Los Angeles glosses, which again, are gonna go over here. I have a Maybelline Lifter Gloss, which are these ones, so I'm going to put that there. I also have a few Ofra glosses that I'm gonna add over here so that they're all in one place. And this one is from Marc Jacobs. This is so old. This is in Sugar Sugar. That's gonna go. Oh, I have one more Ofra one. Oh, this is a blush. Oh no, is this a lip? I don't know if this is a lip color or a blush. I'm confused. I think it's a blush. I don't know if this is a lip gloss in the shade blush or if this is a blush. Um, authentic. It's gotta be blush. It's gotta be a blush. So that's gonna go somewhere else. Um, okay, anyway, moving on. Um, I have a couple of Urban Decay lippies down here. Oh, I actually do have another Ofra though. And it's a gloss. So there we go. For Urban Decay, we have a clear one, which I don't really need a clear gloss, so that one can go. We have Name Drop. This one's really pretty, so we'll keep that one. And then we have Cruisin', which is also a really pretty purple color. And then we have My Dude, which is a red, which I don't think I have any other reds in here, so I'm gonna keep the red. This one is Runyon. Um, I don't know if I like this color that much. So I'm gonna declutter those two. I have a few Dominique Cosmetics glosses. We have Peach Tea and Strawberry Lemonade. These are new. I got rid of the old ones that I had, so I'll keep the new ones. I've got some Juvia's Place glosses as well, which I will be keeping. Um, I have four different colors. I have a few more clear glosses that I'm gonna go ahead and declutter. I have my Glam Light Icy glosses, which I just recently got. So we can add those. I have a Charlotte Tilbury gloss, which once again, I'm gonna add. I have a bunch of these gorgeous blinged beauty glosses. They are so pretty, but I don't have room for all of them. So I think I'm gonna keep the purple and the pink. And since these ones are more like clear, I'm gonna pass those along to somebody else. I have another clear gloss that I'm gonna go ahead and pass along. I have some fancy glosses 
down here, which these I keep in a different drawer, so I'm going to set those aside. Then we have some squeezy tube glosses, so we've got Cherry Coke. This Profusion Mean Girls one is going to go. Um, we've got REM Beauty, which I'm going to keep. We've got Potassium Cosmetics, which I'm going to keep. And then I have a couple of Morphe ones, which I'm also going to be keeping. And finally, I have some Morphe Make It Big. Make it big glosses, yeah. There's like a bunch of them here. Um, so I'm gonna look through these colors. We're gonna keep Big Bang Glow. That one is beautiful. We're gonna keep Posh Petal. We're gonna keep So Fired. And this purple one is cool. Pop and Perp. <laughs> We're gonna keep that one. This one is in the clear. Did I keep a clear gloss? I don't know if I did. So in case I didn't, We'll keep a clear gloss. And then I have these ones. Um, I have Hot Red, Big Sweet Tea, and Nude Showy. Oh, Showy Nude. <laughs> um, you know what, since they fit, we're gonna go ahead and keep them. All right guys, so here is the after of my lip gloss drawer. Everything fits in here. Um, I have a huge declutter pile, so I'm gonna show you guys that in a second, but I'm pretty happy with this. I feel like I could probably get rid of a few more, but since everything fits, I think I'm pretty happy <laughs> with how it all looks. I can see everything. Um, so yeah, I'm happy with this drawer. We're gonna go ahead and move on to the next drawer, which is lipsticks. All right, so here we have lipsticks, and again, there's a lot in here that probably can go um i'm gonna look through my pile that's down here and look for all of the lipsticks so that i can add them to this drawer if needed okay so i don't know if i have all the lipsticks pulled but i have a few down here so let's go ahead and get started i have my charlotte tilbury i'm not gonna get rid of any of my charlotte tilbury lipsticks and i actually have another one that i'm gonna add right here so all of those are going to stay. I also have a few MAC glosses, or lipsticks, I mean, that again, I'm not going to get rid of. And I have a few to add. I have two of these. These are from e.l.f. These are both in the shade Creme. So I'm going to keep one and declutter the other because I don't need two of those. I have this really pretty lipstick from Ilia. This is gonna stay. This is in the shade Amber Light. I have this, which is so old. I used to love this. This is from, oh my God, this looks disgusting. This is from Maybelline. This is the Baddest Beige Lipstick. I used up quite a bit of it, but this needs to go in the trash. It is so freaking old. And then I've got some Juvia's Place lipsticks, which I'm gonna keep. Um, I have, oh boy. I have this one from Fenty, which I'm gonna go ahead and declutter because I never use that, but I am gonna keep the Charlotte Tilbury one. This is interesting. I bought this at Walmart. Definitely not a color that I would use very often. So I'm gonna go ahead and declutter that one. Then we've got a bunch of Morphe glosses, uh, or lipsticks, I keep calling them glosses. But before we get there, let's take a look at these Laura Mercier lipsticks. So we've got this one, which is such a fun color. Definitely not one that I would typically use, but nice to have. And then this one is Beige in Time, which is my favorite lipstick color from Laura Mercier. So we're gonna keep those. Then we've got all of these Morphe lipsticks here, which I need to go through. Um, but we've got a YSL, which I'm going to keep. A Natasha Denona, which I'm going to keep. Wet n Wild, I'm going to keep. And then we have a Milani one over here that I'm also going to keep. So I'm just kind of rearranging. Um, we've got... Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at these Morphe lipsticks. So this one is Single AF. Oh my gosh, that is such a pretty color. Definitely staying. Next, we have the shade Morphe, which again is definitely staying. We've got Steamy. Ooh, that is so pretty. Okay, let's that there we've got this one this one is stunning this is whipped definitely gonna keep that shade 
Then we've got Wifey, which I will be keeping. I love that color. We've got Passionate. Ooh, that is a hot pink. <laughs> And then finally we have Forevs, which is another really pretty cool toned kind of pinky color. So, wow, I thought I was going to get rid of some, but I didn't. So we've got those. And then we've got these three pink ones, which are from the new Disney collection that they came out with. So I'm going to move those there. I have a bunch of these Sephora lipsticks. Oh my God, I just broke this one. Oh no, it's fine. We're good. Um, I'm gonna keep the Sephora ones. Let's take a look at these. So this is a for sure color. This is one or zero one one. Then we've got zero one six, and then we've got zero zero five. Okay, this is rough. I thought I was gonna get rid of a lot more. Um, I have some XO Beauty, and then we've got Buxom. There's definitely a bunch of these Buxom ones that I can get rid of. So we've got Boss. This one is gonna stay. We've got Icon. Oh boy. We've got Influencer. This one is Supermodel. This one is fly girl oh my gosh that one is beautiful what the heck goddess i love goddess goddess is an amazing shade and then we've got heartthrob which again is an amazing shade okay so i think the shade icon um i can uh, i guess i'll go ahead and get rid of that shade because it's a little bit peachier than i would like but honestly <laughs> the rest of these i want to keep um, we've also got a bunch of Urban Decay lipsticks here, so let me open these up and take a peek at the shades. Okay, so I have two shades here that I'm going to declutter just because they're like red kind of colors that I probably won't wear super often. So those two can go. Um, and then I have some Huda Beauty over here. I have some Jaclyn Cosmetics lipsticks, which did you guys see she's redoing these? I'm so freaking excited for that. Like you guys have no idea. I definitely will be doing a video on every single color that she releases. Um, I have a bunch of Buxom products here, some Potassium Cosmetics, and then back here we have lipstick, like, pencils, so I'm gonna take this out and go through these. I have a Gucci lipstick, by the way, that I'm gonna keep, and then this NARS one has to stay. So what has to leave for the NARS one to stay? I also have another Morphe lipstick that I forgot about, which is just great. And then I have these from this brand, Odin's Eye. And these are really cool. I really like the packaging. This is like a super deep red. Let me see what other colors we have. This one's really pretty. This is kind of like a nude color. Let me swatch these Sephora ones and see which ones like I for sure want to keep. Tan Lines is staying. This one is Take a Spin. This is, oh, this is like a shimmery one. Oh, yes, that's beautiful. We've got number seven, which is Love Love. Oh my gosh. I forgot how good these lipsticks were. We've got Somewhere in Spain. I used this one a ton. We've got this one which is brunch date this is my most used from these okay yeah, all of those have to stay <laughs> let's re-look at these buxom ones so we've got heartthrob which is a for sure must we've got goddess which again is a for sure must this one is Fly Girl. That is so freaking pretty. Then we've got Supermodel. I think I can declutter Supermodel. That one can go. This one is Influencer. I like kind of want to keep this just because of the name. Um, and then we've got Boss, which I think I can get rid of Boss. 
this one can go. So I got rid of another two. We've got this one, which can go here. And the NARS one can go here. Those buxom lipsticks smell so freaking good. I've got these, which I don't really have anywhere to put them. So I think we're just gonna go on the side right here for now. And that's just gonna have to work. Also, I'm gonna move these potassium cosmetics glosses up to the lip gloss drawer since they belong up there and they can probably fit there now also my camera battery is about to die all right so here's the after of this drawer here's what i am decluttering not a bunch but at least it's something next we are going to move on to the liquid lipstick drawer and i think we can get rid of a lot from there all right guys we are back with some liquid lips so i actually took a little lunch break but i'm back um i've got a lot of liquid lips in here. I've also got my Fenty glosses back here, which I have a few to add. Um, I am not going to get rid of any of my Fenty glosses. I love these things, and they are all fantastic, so they're all going to stay. However, there's a lot in here that can be decluttered. So I have some glosses here, actually, from Glamlight. I think I'm going to revisit my gloss drawer. I don't know if I'll do it in this video or off camera, but... I need to revisit my gloss drawer because it's still there's still too many glosses so we will figure that out in a second but i will be keeping those glam light glosses um i have some other random things these are kylie cosmetics these are relatively new are these glosses or liquid lips lip shine lip lacquer lip shine lip shine lip shine so all of these are like glossy type products so those are all gonna have to move to my gloss drawer and then we've got my morphe lip liners morphe and mac i have a few over here that i can add i'm not gonna get ready rid of any of these i'm also adding my christian louboutin lip liner now here's where we're gonna be getting rid of some stuff so starting off with this front little section here can you guys see that yes there you can kind of see it we have um quite a bit of stuff i have these wet and wild liquid lips these are just shades that i'm not going to wear so those are going to be decluttered the nars one i am going to keep these two huda beauty ones i'm also going to keep i have a liquid matte and a demi matte um a mac one that i'm gonna keep and then i have all of these bobby brown crushed liquid lips these are honestly all really old and i don't think that they're good anymore so all of these are gonna be decluttered that makes me so sad because i love those things but they are so old like insanely old so we've got mac two little hudas and a little nars Next, we've got some Kaleidos ones, and I'm going to have to go through my Kaleidos lip products, but for now, I'm just going to set them in this front little section here. I also have these ones from the Apple collection, which we're going to toss here. And then I have four more, um, which I have to look through them first. Uh, they're not sitting right next to me, so we'll come back to those. I have a bunch of these Revlon satin inks, and I definitely don't need all of these shades. I also have a few off camera, so let me grab those. Okay, so I think we have two of this shade. Yeah, we have two of these, so I'm going to keep one and declutter the other. This is a pretty color I could see myself wearing. Same with this. Um, and then these... I don't think I'll probably wear these colors, so I'll declutter those three. Uh, actually, I'm decluttering four technically, and I will keep those three. Next, we have some Lunar Beauty. I know I have more than just these two, but I am going to keep my Lunar Beauty liquid lips. Same with my Laura Lee. I have a bunch of Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lips, which these guys are definitely on the older side so we're gonna have to check on these i don't know if i grabbed all of them but here are the ones that i saw so these orangey ones are gonna go i just i know i'm not gonna wear these colors so if i do it would be very infrequently but those are really old anyway these three are really old so those are gonna go 
and then we have these three and the shades we have are pure hollywood um crush and naked i don't remember the last time i bought an anastasia beverly hills liquid lipstick here's another one so i'm gonna declutter all of them which makes me sad but i just i i honestly couldn't tell you the last time i bought one so there's no telling how old those are we got giorgio armani which i'm gonna keep um kylie redid her liquid lips so i'm gonna get rid of this kylie liquid lip i have a couple of koki liquid lips i have like a red and a pinky nude i think i might keep both of those um we've got some maybelline which i'm also gonna keep these i'm pretty sure i have a morphe virgin this believe beauty one is pretty old um, we have a few more Lunar Beauty that I'm gonna keep. I'm getting rid of the Believe Beauty one, by the way. This next one is pretty new. This is Lunar Beauty I'm gonna keep. This is Dragon Beauty. I think I'll keep that. We've got Morphe and KVD. Here we have some other Laura Lee liquid lips. I need to go through all of my Laura Lee liquid lips, so... I have six of them here, but I also have more over on my, like, filming table. So I'm going to set those aside and see if I have duplicates and things like that. And then here we have Ofra liquid lips, which I think are going to stay. And I actually even have more Ofra liquid lips. So I think I might reevaluate my storage of these. I'm going to declutter this little profusion liquid lip and then i'm gonna keep the kvd so here are all of the liquid lipsticks that i have now um I, well actually i have a ton of these lip stains from odin's eye and i don't i need to look at the colors i literally have like 12 boxes so i'm gonna go through these really quick and see what colors i'm gonna keep and then i'll probably like stick them in right over here all right you guys so here is my lip liquid lipstick drawer now i unwrapped these from odin's eye and i have my colitis ones down here um everything looks good i have a bunch of these and i wish that i had a place for them but i kind of don't so let me see if i can find a place for all of these color pop lippy sticks um, and then I'm going to show you guys everything that I'm decluttering, and I think we did pretty good today. Okay, so I'm actually getting rid of all of these lip glosses as well. So we're getting rid of an additional 3, 6, 9, 12. Um, I still had, like, those Glam Light glosses and the Kylie glosses, which I was able to fit in here. So I have, like, my Kylie ones here, my Glam Light ones here. So here is my lip gloss drawer. It is full. Every single space is taken besides the ones that I like can't reach back there. But I really like how this drawer turned out. So there's our lip gloss drawer. Here is our lipstick drawer. I added these ColourPop lippy sticks here because, you know, they fit. It's not the most aesthetically pleasing, but it works. And then here's my liquid lipstick drawer, which again, I am pretty happy with. Now, I have this drawer, which is like lip balms and stuff um i i guess we'll go through this we can go through this and see what we can get rid of i accidentally had these two in my declutter pile those are liquid lipsticks so these are the additional lip glosses that i'm decluttering i just had to make room so sacrifices had to be made but here is everything else that i'm decluttering all of these lipsticks there are a ton of them there's lip glosses liquid lipsticks, bullet lipsticks, lip oils, lip stains, all kinds of stuff. So I feel like we did really good. <laughs> Here they all are. Now it's time to go through the lip balms and lip scrubs and stuff like that that I have. So let me get, set you guys up on the tripod and let's get going. All right, guys. So here we have lip masks, lip scrubs, that sort of thing. Um, let's get going. So I have this Algenist thing this is so incredibly old so that's going to be decluttered um i have this from pure which is a rejuvenating lip treatment i'm gonna go ahead and declutter that um this little lip scrubber is kind of old from sephora so i'm gonna get rid of that we have the tatcha lip mask i'm gonna keep kylie skin hydrating lip mask and then i have a few of these fresh sugar masks which are really nice i have these lush lip scrubs which are 
probably old. Let's check the dates on here. Um, yes, that one is old, and yes, that one is old. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and declutter both of these. I have Unicorn and Galaxy. I have this MAC Candied Nectar Lip Scrub that I'm gonna keep. This Fresh Rose one, this is a soft lip cream. I'm gonna go ahead and declutter that. This Kaja one I'm gonna keep. And then I have two Kaleidos lip masks, so we'll keep both of those. I have this little e.l.f. one, which, I don't know. I guess I'll keep it. Um, and then I have a bunch of these. I'm gonna keep the ColourPop lip scrub, that's the Lizzie McGuire one. And then I have a bunch of these Laneige lip masks. So let me take a peek. This Aquaphor is going to be decluttered. I think I'm going to get rid of this bite size lip balm. I just don't think I'm going to use it. So we've got Peppermint, which for sure I will be keeping. We've got this one, which is Sweet Candy. Mmm, smells so good. Again, I will definitely be keeping that one. Mint Choco. I think I'm going to declutter Mint Choco just because... This is a big thing to go through and I don't really like that scent as much as I like these other ones. Then we have apple lime. I'm definitely gonna keep apple lime. And then we have vanilla, which is always yummy. So vanilla will stay, apple lime will stay, sweet candy and peppermint. Then I have some more over here. I've got like minis and stuff. So for minis, I have the grapefruit one, which I'll keep. I have apple lime, which I'll declutter. I have the original, which I'll keep, and then sweet candy, which I will keep. So the only one I'm gonna get rid of is apple lime because I have the full size. Then I have the little squeezy tube ones, which I'm gonna keep all of those. I also have the like yellow one somewhere. I just don't know where it is. This lip balm is really old. This is gonna be decluttered, but I really love it. Then we have this little mini milk makeup thing that I'm gonna keep. This uh, Glow Recipe lip pop is amazing. I'm gonna keep that. These are newer Sol de Janeiro lip balms. And then I have these ones from Benefit. These are really pretty, but I don't think I'm gonna use them in here. So I'm gonna move them to my lipstick drawer. Back here we have a bunch of squeezy tube. <laughs> lip products all of these glossier ones are old they need to go we have rosebomb.com birthdaybomb.com and berrybomb.com i love these but like i said those are all super old then i have um an elf one and a jouet one so i'll keep the jouet and i'll keep the elf we've got a ton of copari ones as well so i just want to keep like one of each so we've got sangria watermelon Birthday suits, Sunset Kiss, the original, Pink Haze, and then I have two more birthday suits. This one is new and this one is used, so let me check the other birthday suit. This one is also used, so I'll keep the two used ones. I'll get rid of the one that's new, and then I have some backups back here, which I don't need. These are the original lip glossy, so these three can go. And that's everything for this drawer. I feel like I did pretty good. I'm proud of myself. <laughs> so um, let me show you the pile of stuff that I'm decluttering from this drawer, and I think that's gonna conclude our lip product declutter. Here is everything from my lip balm drawer that I'm decluttering. I'm also watching Cypher PK, play Fortnite. <laughs> anyway, um, all of this stuff will be added to my declutter pile, so let me scoot this over and give you one final overview of everything that I'm decluttering. All right, guys, so here we have the final lip declutter pile. I'm really happy with this. I got rid of a lot, and I feel like, you know, everything fits in my drawers now, so I can see it all, and I can get to it and I know I have it. This was a nice reminder and refresher of everything that I have, but here is an overview. I'm super, super happy with this. Um, <laughs> now I'm not looking forward to cleaning all this up and all this like trash over here, but um, that was today's Vlogmas video. I hope you guys enjoyed Vlogmas Day 21. Tomorrow, what should we do tomorrow? Face palettes? I feel like face palettes would be a good video tomorrow. Um, so we still have face palettes. We still have eyeshadow palettes that need to be done. And then we have highlighters. Maybe we'll do highlighters tomorrow. That sounds good. Um, highlighters, we've got face palettes, we've got eyeshadow palettes. And then that's like pretty much all of the makeup categories 
that I can think of. I've got to do some packing still, some cleaning still. There's so much we have to do before we move out, but you know, every little bit of progress is good progress. So that was today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. I love you all so, so much. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.